In December 2015, it was discovered that hydrogen sulfide was the best superconductor. A good superconductor is one that works close to room temperature. Superconductors provide no resistance to electrons travelling through it. To give you perspective on the temperatures we're dealing here, with here, here is a Kelvin thermometer. Zero degrees Kelvin is absolute zero. Nothing moves, not even atoms. At 75 degrees Kelvin, nitrogen begins to boil. The previous record holder for the best superconductor was 165 Kelvin. The coldest temperature to be ever recorded on Earth was 180 Kelvin. Our new superconductor works at up to 203 Kelvin. At 300 Kelvin is room temperature. To convert Kelvin into Celsius, you first subtract 273 from the, the temperature in Kelvin and that will give you your, your temperature in Celsius. The hydrogen sulfide is more like H3S due to the 888,231 atmospheres of pressure caused by crushing it between two diamonds. This discovery was made by Michaeli Emmermetz and his colleagues at the Max Planck Institute for Chemistry. So why is this important? The application of room temperature superconductors would be immense. From MRI machines, colliders, detectors and transistors we would save so much money and energy with room temperature superconductors. This is because MRI machines require helium coolant to keep the super superconductors cool. Not to mention, we lose up to 30% of the energy that we produce from just transporting it to other places. With room temperature superconductors, we will be able to use more of the energy that we produce.